Hello, hello. How are you guys? Hello. I have Jennifer. I do have Elwin, Gabby. Hello. How are you guys? Ollie, welcome to the jungle. Gabby, hi, hi, hi. How are you guys? How's your day going? So far, good evening. Go? Good evening. Good evening. How pretty, are you? Ah, pretty good. Pretty, pretty good. With a, with a, it's really hot here, but it's okay. <laughs> hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Fine. Fine. That's amazing. I'm so happy. Yay! Everybody's here. Let me check. I gotta do something here. Let me just one minute. Let me fix it. Something. There you go. I'm sorry, guy, but I wasn't uh, with the other guys right now. So that's why I came a little bit late, but I'm here. Because we were talking about, um, what was the name of that? Ah, yes. We were talking about indirect questions. So that's the reason why. Hey, guys, tell me, how was your weekend? How was your weekend, guys? Was it good? Yes, it's a fine. It's a fine. Yes. Okay, Oli. I know because you're on vacation. I understand that perfectly. <laughs> uh -huh. So, uh -huh. so tell me, what yes. did you do if you're on vacation? <laughs> very nice. Very nice. Free. I'm free. free. <laughs> I'm free. Yay. Okay. Yeah. So, what did yes, you do in the I first finish, week? I finished platform. Yeah. You read the platform? Yeah. I'm yeah. so happy you broke my heart. Yes. Very good. Very good. And, and you got a 10? Yes. Yeah, finish and certificate. Yeah. Yeah. Very good. <laughs> because I remember that you were like uh, having a battle with your son, right? <laughs> yeah, right. Your son with you. You're supposed to finish like uh, who's finished yes. first? And who got 100%. Oh, that's amazing. Very good. Hopefully the rest guys are working fine on the platform. Okay. Excellent job. So only finish the platform. That's amazing. Uh -uh. Yes. It, it is my challenge. I'm a song. I know. You told us that <laughs> last time. Thank you, Oli. I think Edwin is raising his hand. What happened, Edwin? Nothing. I just want to say to Hi. everybody hello. Hey, but I want to see you. Doesn't matter if you're a completely disaster. That's okay. <laughs> uh, very good. You see, you're not a completely disaster. Come on. Hey, I want to see your faces, your beautiful smiles. Come on. Yeah. Edwin, how was your week? Was it good? Uh, it's just a good one. A little bit tired, but it's okay. I'm so glad. I'm so glad I'm happy to see you. Thank you, Edwin. What about you, Elenita? How was your weekend? My weekend is very good, thanks God. But the last week is um, is a little sad because my father is sick, but is the weekend is better and better. And oh. thanks God is is today is a good day for the, for him. And I glad for that yeah of course we're happy as well that your dad is is recovering so that's amazing yes so that means that was a really good weekend because the daddy is getting fine that's amazing thank you lenita what about you gabriela gutierrez it's your turn <laughs> <laughs> thank you hi hi well we were with my family on sunday uh saying goodbye to my sister because she's going to travel to orlando this coming thursday oh okay she's sleeping but, but just see. for vacation <laughs> no but just uh, because uh her daughter uh lives there ah okay mm -hmm. so that's why oh she always uh Said that we, uh, if we can have a lunch or something, because you know nobody knows if I, well, we can see her again, right? Mm -hmm. So that's why well, we were just in family. Mm -hmm. Oh, but that's amazing! Did you cook? No, 
No, <laughs> we bought uh, uh, sopa de pata. <laughs> Feed soup. <laughs> it's delicious. Yeah. yeah. It, there's no That's translation so actually to that. Sopa de pata, sopa oh. de pata all over the world. Sopa de pata is the proper name. <laughs> it's, like, it's like pupusas. There's no yeah. translation. Mm -hmm. There's no translation. Mm -hmm. uh -huh, very good. Yeah. Ah, I thought you yeah. prepared it. Ah, come on. No. no. Kind of difficult. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, well, there's, there's some to... other work. To know to cook that kind of soap because you have, you have to give it the the taste, the the, flavor. this good taste, right? Uh -huh, the, how the flavor. It's mm -hmm. Amazing! It's amazing. Yes. I, I <laughs> always really remember good. my grandma. I don't know. You know what? I remember huh? that I was a little, not a little baby, but around six years old. I remember, and my grandma used to prepare a uh, sopa de pata by uh, by heart. It was really delicious. That was one of her specialties. Mm -hmm. So yeah, when she prepared no, it, uh -huh. I, I was the ingredient, the same ingredients. Yeah, but you know what? I got sick once <laughs> because really? I, I, yeah, yeah, because Good. I had sopa de pata as a breakfast as a lunch, oh as a dinner, <laughs> and as a break, break time. Well. So I, wow. I got diarrhea okay. because of that, but it's, I said, it's worth it, Mama. It's worth it. It was delicious. Mm -hmm. It was delicious. That's yes. Right. <laughs> uh -huh. Yeah, but oh, I, okay. you know what? She used to make like a huge one with this. Oh, my God. Mm -hmm. And all of it disappears. I love it. It's shopping on you. Yes, uh, <laughs> definitely. I, I don't know how you say that, but there was like all kind of kitchen that the grandmas used to use. This what's the call in Spanish? Poyeton, I think so. Poyeton, right? Yes. Yeah, right. Okay. So she used to have a kitchen like that way. So can you imagine? <laughs> My okay. grandmother has one. Really, Jenny? Yes. And she she used to cook like, like that way in that place, yeah. Yes. Oh, I don't know why, but the the grannies had a, a specially taste, right, guys? Everything yes, tastes especially so I, I really like the bean soap. Yes, that she prepares on on that. It's I don't I don't know that. why, but every time you knock the door, you smell and all cheese. the preparations, and like you said, oh my god, nobody cooks like my grand. Yes. yes, you're right about that. Even though the spaghetti with sauce and cream i don't know what they put on but they you know what i try to follow the her recipe by heart but to be honest with you it will never taste the same i don't know why never never and i miss my granny because of that well what i call it because a lot of things but especially the way she used to cook my especially is lasagna really letty Oh, oh, how do you Let prepare me. it? My good Italian I, food, you know? Um, uh, hace mucho tiempo? Long time ago. Long time. Uh, uh, last time I work in Pizza Hut. Ah, ah yeah. that's the reason why you stole the recipe. <laughs> <laughs> But, but what is your specialty? The bolognese lasagna? Bolognese, bolognese the lasagna, Caesar salad, and uh, mm, I mean, like, uh, um, do it, do it, can do it, you can do it. What? Subway? Subway. Like a subway one. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh, uh, spaghetti. In uh, different, um, different, uh, different salad bar. Uh huh. Different salad bar. Uh, bean salad, uh, potato salad, repollo, cabbage, cabbage, <laughs> red chicken. <laughs> no cabbage. Come on, <laughs> red chicken, guys. No cabbage. Come on, let's see. <laughs> <laughs> Shame on you, lady. <laughs> uh, okay, it's um, a preparated uh, pizza, different uh, special specialties. Uh, specialties pizza. Goodness. So, can you imagine a perfect dinner? You can ask Letty uh, a Bolognese lasagna, a Caesar salad. 
and a glass of wine. You see? Perfect dinner. Delicious. Perfect romantic. Exactly, right, Jenny? Perfect romantic yeah. dinner. Uh, uh, a bread of uh, uh, garlic. Garlic bread. Garlic bread. Oh, oh yeah. That was a, yeah, that was a, the, the information with that was cheese, with cheese. With cheese. With oh, cheese. Oh, okay. with melted cheese. Ooh, no way. Uh, a cheese in um, Morocco. Morocco. Oh, yeah. You know what? <laughs> I mean, I mean uh, red bean soup with Morocco. And it tastes, yeah, it tastes good. The person is uh, um, my, um, how do you say the master? The master chef. The master, the master chef. <laughs> the master chef um, and come on, Leticia. Uh, I may um, approve, approve the different uh, ingredients. Ingredients? Ingredients. Ingredients. Uh, para the uh, ayudarle a los clientes a, a saber cómo hacer las ensaladas. Sí, big salad, big, big, big salad. You know what? My my sister used to be one of the ones who really can make a big salad from the bar salad of uh uh, uh what's the name? Pizza hat. Yeah. I when I when we always want that salad bar, I told her, you know what, you gotta go and prepare it. And she's like, she put like a huge one like this. So I, okay. I think five people had like three times salad. Can you imagine? I don't know how she does it, <laughs> but she can't prepare it. But you know what? Right now it's a little bit expensive, Leti. Because I remember that the bar salad started cost like $3.50. Imagine three fifty, three dollars and fifty cents, and now it's twelve dollars. And I was like, "Wow, it's my body, delicious. body worth it. It's delicious." It's, it's, like, it's an explosion. The, the yes, life. yes, I know that for sure. Yeah, yeah. Well, once I have money, <laughs> hey. I have a, on a mini, a mini restaurant in my house. Okay. Yeah. You know what? You can send us with WhatsApp the, the address, the telephone number, and it's for delivery. And definitely we're going to ask you for. For the end of the course. Yeah, that no, would be amazing if we can see each other, guys. Ah, you know what? I used to make like a parties with my with my babies, Hawaiian parties or something like that. But now that we cannot see each other, it's really hard. Yeah, the last one was at the airport. We made a Hawaiian party. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And we prepare a lot of things. I mean, I mean, I think right because it, we had to find like a, a small place to do it, but it was really nice. Well, hopefully, guys, we can see each other in person one day. Who knows that? Eh? When you get your your diplomas, maybe I I will be there. <laughs> maybe. Maybe yes. Maybe who knows that. Eh? Especially it's if, it's if, very good idea. Especially if you're on Saturday, because that's the only time that I can be on the uh at the academy on Saturdays. Yeah, it's only on Saturdays. Yes, because of the, all my other job that I have, I use I cannot. Uh, hey guys, I have to let you know something. Uh, we're going to have a vacation uh, August vacation. Okay. I have to let you know that. So that means I know you love me. I love you too. But during the week of vacation, we're not going to see each other. Okay. I have to let you know that. That's really nice. <laughs> yes, Lisa, I know for sure. You love vacation, right? <laughs> then is that, that this? is beginning this coming Monday. I think so. I think so, Gabby. Or until Thursday. Until, until the night, I think. Uh-huh. Um, I, I, I will ask exactly the dates and I will let you know, guys. That's the reason okay. why I'm going to ask the dates is because, to be honest with you, I don't have a vacation. So I don't know the vacations here in El Salvador. Um, but because I'm not, I don't have vacation. I'm a person who used who is used to work on vacations. Not in El Because I don't work for somebody here in El Salvador. I work for somebody outside. So... I only have vacations, the regular annual vacations, but not the vacations here, not the vacations there. Well, only the two main ones. 
I think I have 4 of July. I think I have Thanksgiving. And what else? Easter. Uh, no, Easter, no. Ah, yes. I have the, um, what's the name of the, Memorial Day. I remember that. Uh, Memorial that Memorial Day, that is the, um, May the 31st. Well, we celebrate all the people that went to the Vietnam War. Oh, 11, right? 11 of November. No, it is uh, Memorial Day is the 31st of May. Uh, oh. Thanksgiving is the last Thursday of November. Thursday. Yeah, yeah. And Black Friday, of course, is the, right next to Friday, right? And then I have 4 of July, that is the um, Independence Day of the United States. But um, I don't have anything else. So you work for the United States? Yes, I do. Nice. Yes. <laughs> yeah, so so it's really stressful. So it depends on which company you work for and depends on the people that they related to, right? If, for example, they related to schools, all the school vacation, they have vacations as well. But it depends on the, of the company you work for. So that's why I'm going to ask guys for a specific days you're going to have an off because I don't know them exactly. I know that it's the first week of August, right? So you have yes. a vacation, right? Is that right? Okay. Yeah. So let me find it out with them. And I think that they're going to send you like information about it. But just in case, I'm going to ask them, okay? I'm going to ask them about the vacations, when we're going to start the vacation and when we're going to come back. Okay? Just to let you know in advance. Mm -hmm. So I, I know that you're going to miss me. I understand that perfectly. <laughs> yeah, especially Lisa, she said, yeah, right? And you know what? Ollie's going to be lucky because she's on vacation and she still will have another vacation of a vacation. That's amazing, Ollie. <laughs> no, no. I work at two uh, hours. Ah. Yeah. The first week of August? It's she's late. She did the work. Ah, ah, okay. So she's not going to be lucky at all. It's, yes. The, vac uh, the vacation, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis de agosto. And Only. that's it, right? Yes. But at least you're going to have vacation. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you see, she's mad. And I'm not going to have vacation. No. I, I know. I, I, I'm not a... Uh, um, no, como se dice había, no había tenido vacaciones durante un, un years, un, un año y medio. Ah, one year and a half. Yes. You hadn't had vacation. No. So you deserve it. You deserve it. But I need your reset. Yes, of course. Definitely. Two, two week only. <laughs> but that's it. So that means that you have a, your annual yes. vacation already, right? We can say that. Yes. That's good. <laughs> okay, that's wonderful. Yes. <laughs> I only she's she's mean right sometimes. <laughs> that, that's good. Thank you, Oli. What about you, okay. Roxy? How was your weekend? Tell us. It was good. On Saturday, I I worked with my mother on in the morning, mm -hmm. and the afternoon I stayed at home, and but. Uh, Sunday on Sunday, I went to the the church in the morning, and in the in the afternoon I watch TV with my mother. Movies. Movies. What kind of movies? Uh, series of oh, the Netflix. Fifty K. Fifty K. No, no, I don't have. I don't have. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, Roxy. What? No, Fifty Chains and Grey. I don't understand. Watch, watch, uh, watch movie. Fifty Chains and Grey, Roxy. Fifty Chains. No, Fifty Chains of Grey. Fifty Chains. What? What is? <laughs> I don't know. I know. Which? It's a series. Yeah. No. <laughs> No, right? It's a movie, it's a right? movie, Roxana. It's a movie. Uh, it's, it's, it's three movies. Ah, uh, uh, it's a lot of. Okay, uh, I, yes. I, 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 I saw. 
It's so. very nice. Uh, it's very nice. It look. Uh, it's <laughs> double X or three or not. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Yes. I, haven't, I haven't seen it. <laughs> yes. The is. Black Widow. It's a little speaking romantic. Black Widow. The Black Widow. Black Widow. <laughs> <The Black Panther. laughs> <laughs> oh my god i think something happens on the weekend because that affects everybody right <laughs> yeah. i'm just teasing you guys very good so i'm but so it's happy. a little interesting that movie really I'm so uh, part which, of the movie. which one the black move the black widow you said the first in the in the second part ah i, I like it the, uh, it's a romantic movie i think I don't know. I haven't, I haven't seen it before. So that's good. Thank you, Roxy. Hi, ah, you spent time with your mama. That's nice. That's nice. Thank yes. You. Thank you, Roxy. What about you, Sarita? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. I mm, very good. Really? Why? Yes. Tell us. Yeah. I'm in the Saturday morning. Uh-huh. I'm cooking the fried fish Ooh. for my mother. I wow, delicious! Yes, ella feliz, very happy. Yeah, of course she was happy. Why not? Yes, in the Sunday in the church in family. Mm -hmm. In the morning, and in afternoon, watch TV. Movies. Oh, you watch TV? Yes. Oh, Movie. Very good. Movies in the Amazon. Amazon. Okay. Yes. Okay, that's amazing. That's cool. Very cool. Of course, it's very cool. That's amazing. Mm. Hey, guys, are you paying attention, right? By any chance? No. Uh -huh. Demand is in silence. The, I don't know why they are in silence. What about you, yes. Rainer? Mr. Osorio, how was your weekend, sir? Hello. Hello. We want to see your beautiful face. Don't Hello. worry. Your hair like is a completely disaster. That's okay. I'm sorry. Yes. I'm sorry. Don't uh, tell me that your camera is not working because I don't believe No, no, it. no. It's my head is. My head is Bang. Oh, you have a headache. Oh, headache. I'm sorry yes. to hear that. Oh, yes. No. <laughs> Here we are. Uh, I yes. think you look tired. <laughs> Very tired since this weekend. Today is um, very crazy in the job. Oh, I can't imagine. You're really stressful. Yes, yes, yes. And the, the, the manager production, uh, oh, wow. we don't have fiber. <laughs> the, 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 the boat with the fiber is the layer. Uh, mm -hmm. It's a crazy. So the, today was a really nuts day. Nuts. Nuts, yes, yes, it's nuts. nuts. And Saturday, yeah, even yesterday, and today is nuts. Okay. Oh my God, I'm sorry to hear that. But I'm so happy, Rainer, that even though it has been a really tough and crazy day for you, you're still here. Yes. And it shows your commitment, you're willing to learn, which is really good. Yes. So don't worry, good. if you want to turn it off your camera, I understand. You can fall asleep. Okay. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Rainer. Okay, guys, he said crazy. He said nuts, right? I wrote it on the chat nuts. right now. Nuts is another is another way to say crazy. Okay, yeah. that's another word. Nuts. But it's okay. Yes, of course it's okay. It's nuts, and it's exactly the same way that you write, for example, the little seed that the squirrels eat. The nuts is exactly yes. the same way. Yeah, but it's it's another way. So if you somebody said crazy, it, but nuts, guys, is. It's, it's not like a simple crazy. Nuts is more than crazy. It's, it is a synonym. It's a synonym. Because it's very it is a, crazy. Exactly. So it was crazy by heart. If you say nuts, that means that was crazy by heart. Like almost kill yourself, like something like that, right? Like, ah. 
like something is overwhelming you know what overwhelming is no no overwhelming. I, I don't know ah, ah that's another word for you okay overwhelming okay and what's the meaning okay for example like rainer uh, let's let's say that his job is very tough he had an economic situation that was really uh, difficult for him uh, his mother is sick for example right he has many bad situations and he has a lot of things here like uh, he's about to lose his mind so it's overwhelming that is he has a lot of things over his shoulders that he cannot handle anymore that that okay. is overwhelming when something is like oh my god this is too much i can with all the things i'm overwhelmed can you write it please yes of course don't worry about it uh, this is the first time that you Over. that you uh listened that word overwhelmed yeah. yes but yes, have, have you heard it before no the stress no. And and the same with the nuts is the first sign for the me first to listen time. that expression. Oh. Okay, Th that's why I I am um, I try to share with you because guys sometimes you need to like um how can I say it? to increase your vocabulary and of course to know a lot of synonyms because. There will be a lot of people that will use that and you know what's going on with that right you can set a lot of that okay overwhelm overwhelming and you turn off the microphone my Who, me no no sé si Lisette or jennifer creo que es Lisette. Oh, yeah. thank you i don't know Liz, why? Is it sounds like different? Tac, 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 tac. Ah, yes. Okay, wait a minute. Overwhelmed. Leti is el grillo. Un grillo cadenario. Overwhelmed, okay. guys, I'm going to write it down to things. Overwhelmed is you feel it. Like, like the person is overwhelmed, but the situation is overwhelming, okay? The person feels overwhelmed, like oh, I cannot hold it anymore. But the, every the situation is overwhelming. So when you're talking about it situation, specifically, is whelming. And when you're talking about the person itself, how you feel about something, if you feel stressed, you feel overwhelmed. Okay, so that's why I'm going to write it down two things: overwhelm. <laughs> There you go. Okay, there you go. Overwhelmed, overwhelmed, like I'm overwhelmed. It means I, I almost throw the toilet, the, the towel, right? I almost give up because this is too much for me. All the situation, all the things that are happening to me right now, they are overwhelming. That means God, that you are you cannot handle them anymore. You cannot take control of them anymore. That's what it means. Do you oh, understand, well, well. Rainer? Okay, I, I can't. I cannot. I cannot hear you. Sorry. Turn your microphone. On, yes. Hey, yes. No. No. Please repeat. Okay. I I send. Uh, if you, can you see the chat right now? Yes. 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 yes okay. Yes. Okay. Right now, Rainer. Because you have a lot of things to do, maybe, right? Your stressful job, maybe you have some family issues. I don't know, whatever, right? Sometimes we have a lot of problems that we feel like, like if we are like, let me, can, how can I say? Like if we are like this, like this, right? Like this, right? Yeah. So that means that you feel overwhelmed as a person. You said, oh my God, that's too much. That's the first word that I sent you in the chat. Overwhelmed. When somebody's tired, oh, well, well, okay, of is tired of, of getting a lot of things on the back, right? A lot of circumstances, a lot of difficult situations. But the situation, that means this pillow is a situation, right? This pillow, it is 
on your shoulders and is this okay. pillow this situation is overwhelming okay, ah, okay. that's the difference now very good it's really important you see guys you're gonna learn something new every day overwhelming, yeah. overwhelming. yes and guys today uh, that's why we started with um with asking you how was your week or how was your weekend? Because sometimes guys, uh, you gotta tell the stories, right? About what had happened to you. Uh, it could be recent stories, like what, how was your last weekend? But could be something unusual. And it's really important guys to learn vocabulary to express yourself, okay? Today, what we are gonna learn is going to be something interesting. Let me let you know, because um, we're going to learn more information about how to become a good storyteller. You know what a storyteller is? No? Yes. Yes, like, you know what happened? <gasps> okay, they were, everybody was in front of the fire, right? And I was like, once upon a time, there was a beautiful girl. <laughs> right like exactly <laughs> like if you're listening a tale a story tale but you gotta learn positive and negative okay and negative adjectives or words in order for you to like increase your vocabulary and will be able to not only to express yourself but to sound a uh, interesting your story okay so i'm gonna i'm gonna share something right now with you and what I want you to do uh, with that is something in particular, guys. I'm going to share with you some adverbs. Adverbs. And I want you guys not only to let me know what's the meaning in Spanish, but at the same time to let me know if they are positive ones, if they are negative ones, or if they are neutrals. Okay? That's what I want right now. So allow me just a couple of minutes. Let me share it right now and just let me know as soon as you got it, okay? There you go. I sent it right now. Do you do you have it, guys? Yep. Yes. Okay, cool. Yes. I, I don't know how many adverbs are. Mm. Yes, there you go. Okay, I got it here. There you go. Okay, guys, we have one, two, three, four, five, like 10, right? 10 adverbs, I think so. That's what I sent it to you, 10 adverbs. Okay, guys, so may I ask you, what is coincidentally? What does it mean in Spanish? Or if you want to explain it to you in English, that's nice for me. Very good. Fortunately. Mucha suerte. What? Like a fortunado. Very good, excellent. Aha, uh -huh. but what is luckily? Like <laughs> exactly. Miraculously. Milagrosamente. Sadly. Tristemente. Strangely. Extraña. 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 Yeah. Remember that is adverb. Adverb in Spanish always ends with mente, right? Mente. Always. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Suddenly. Repentinamente. Repentinamente. Surprisingly. Sorpresivamente. Very good. Unexpectedly. Inexplicablemente. Inesperadamente. Yes. Unexpectedly in love. You see? Desafortunado. Exactly. And unfortunately, is the opposite one. Unfortunately, right? Desafortunadamente. Exactly. Now, guys, tell me something. Coincidentally, is it positive, negative, or neutral ever? What do you think? Neutral. 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 Yeah, neutral depends, ever. right? Uh huh. Okay. What about fortunately? Positive. 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 Luckily. Positive. Positive. Miraculously. Positive. Sadly. Negative. Oh, strangely. Neutral. Neutral, right? Because you don't know, right? Depends. Yes, depends. What about suddenly? Neutral too. Neutral too. Neutral, very good. Surprisingly? Neutral. It could be positive, it could be neutral as well. Yes. 
unexpectedly. Neutral. 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 And unfortunately, oh, oh, negative. negative. And of course, that's negative, negative for sure. Yeah. Okay, before we go into deeply on that, uh, we're going to practice the pronunciation. Right? Because that's really important. So, massage your cheeks. <laughs> because we are going to use them by heart. Yes. So I'm sorry if it's going to hurt you at the end, right? I'm sorry for that. Okay. Look into my mouth, guys. Coincidentally. Coincidentally. I, I don't hear you. Come on. Coincidentally. Coincidentally. Very good. Fortunately. Fortunately. Luckily. 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 This is a really good one. Miraculously. Miraculously. This is a good one. Sadly. 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 Strangely. Strangely. Suddenly. Suddenly. Look into my mouth. I do not open it. Suddenly. 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 Very good. Suddenly. And you know what? It looks like Colgate smell, right? Suddenly. <laughs> <laughs> you just remember that. Yeah, suddenly. Suddenly. Uh -huh. <laughs> All righty. Surprisingly. 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 Unexpectedly. 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 Unfortunately. 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 I told you we'll hurt your cheeks a little bit. Okay, yeah. let's do it again, but let's do it on the back, on reverse, right? Unfortunately. Unfortunately. Unexpectedly. 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 Surprisingly. Well, got this mouth suddenly. Suddenly. <laughs> <laughs> ah, that's easy one, well, yeah. It's strangely. It's strangely. Sadly. Sadly. Miraculously. Miraculously. Luckily. Luckily. Look into my mouth. Luckily. Luckily. Fortunately. Fortunately. Coincidentally. Coincidentally. Okay. Volunteer to say everything? <laughs> yes. Okay, I, I Roxy. Tried. Give it a try, I my will girl. Try. Give it a try. I will Go try ahead. it. Coincidentally, fortunately, luckily, miraculously, suddenly, strangely, suddenly, surprisingly, surprisingly, <laughs> surprisingly, <laughs> unexpectedly, Unfortunately. Hey, very good. Very good. Roxy, especially the suddenly. I like it because she said, yeah. suddenly? <laughs> She's showing her cold goddess smile, right? <laughs> yeah. You see? Oh, that is like brown. I remember that. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You know what? That is an easy peasy queasy one because if you remember that, you're going to pronounce it correctly. Suddenly? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And, and, you were, and you know what? And, and all your family will watch you that you're practicing the pronunciation and like, why my mama is so smiley today? No idea, <laughs> right? Or oh, oh, in the case of Roxy, why my daughter is so smiley today? I don't have any idea. She was like, suddenly? <laughs> that will be amazing, right? <laughs> Very good. Thank you, Roxy. Let me put something Pleasure. here. Pleasure. Yeah. You see? You broke my heart. Who else? Volunt Elwin, what about you? Thank you, Elwin. I know you would like to participate like <laughs> <laughs> I can open my my WhatsApp. If I open, I get out from the the union. So I, I uh, uh, no, but you know what? That is no excuse. So don't worry. <laughs> I'm going to share my screen with you. Okay, hi with the teacher. You this this teacher is a little bit nuts. <laughs> so don't worry about that. <laughs> and Elenita is like yes. Thank you, Elenita. <laughs> Okay, so allow me just a couple of minutes, Mr. Elwin. Elenita, very bad. Yeah, yeah, she is sometimes. Uh-huh. I'm going to make her a little bit bigger. 
Okay, and I'm gonna share right now my screen with them. So, Mr. Elwin, you're going to pronounce it, all right? Okay, go ahead. A little bit bigger. A little bit bigger, oh my goodness. Okay, what about Gosh. now? Much better? Okay. Yes, Miss. Wow. Oof. Okay. Uh -huh. Coincidentally. Very good. Fortunately. Uh huh. Luckily. Uh huh. Mirac miraculously. Miraculously. Uh -huh. Sorry. Miraculously. Miraculously. Mm -hmm. and, and sorry, sorry, sadly, sadly, mm -hmm. strangely, mm -hmm. suddenly, 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 very good, yes. got the smile, surprisingly, very good, in unexpectedly, un unexpectedly, and uh. unfortunately, 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 no, un, you have the UN. Is un, unexpected. Um, un. Uh -huh, like un. Unexpectedly. Un. Mm -hmm, very unexpectedly. good. Hey, do me a favor because I didn't see you. Hey, repeat suddenly, please. Suddenly. 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 Very good. You see, that called got the smile works fine. Suddenly. Yeah, hey, Roxy like it. <laughs> uh, yeah, good. I like it. But yeah. I remember. Oh. Yeah. yeah, you see, that's yeah. a really good trip, right? Yeah, go yeah. smile. Who else? Your Another. <laughs> yeah, it, it really works. Definitely. What about Carlito Guevara? Are you able to um, turn off your camera or Jose Guzman or Paolo? Hey, Carlitos, it's nice to see. I, he, you know what? He was wearing pajamas next to the bed. He was about <laughs> to go to jumping. Woohoo! English class finished. Yeah. Ah, you see? He was like, okay. <laughs> okay, Carlitos, are you ready? Are you in the WhatsApp group? Or would yes. you want me to mm. share the, the screen? No. no. In, in WhatsApp group. Okay, go ahead, Carlitos. Mm -hmm. Coincidentally, mm -hmm. fortunately, luckily, miraculously, sadly, strange, strangely, suddenly, surpri surprisingly, unexpectedly, Unfortunately. 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 Uh -huh. Unfortunately. And the one. Unfortunately. Uh, exactly. And the one before is suddenly is strangely. Strangely. Yes. Strangely. Very good. And the other one, sadly. 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 Uh, Carlitos, do me a favor because I want to see your face. So could you please repeat suddenly for us? Mm, okay. uh -huh. I like that. Say suddenly. Suddenly. You see, Colgate smile. I like it. <laughs> Very good, Carlito. Thank you. Let's listen. Thank you so much for turning on your camera. Okay. Very good. Ah, I thought he was in a, in a hamaca or something like that, but no, he was next to the bed. <laughs> That's amazing, Carlito. Thank you. What about Jose? Jose Guzman? Jose. Jose. No. Can you turn it off your camera or you are lying on bed Why? already? Because <laughs> I want to see his suddenly smile. I would like to see oh, your face. Smile. Yes. <laughs> All right. Oh my, uh, you see he has a hammock on the back. I knew it. Yeah, <laughs> I have this. <laughs> I got, I Jose. Okay, Jose, it's because we want to see your, your, your smile, right? It's really? Yeah, <laughs> hey, hey, you see, very good. So go ahead, sir. I, Please repeat, right. repeat it. All right. Coincidentally, mm -hmm. fortunately, luckily, miraculously, sadly, strangely, suddenly, uh, uh, surprising. Uh, hey, 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 suddenly. Hey. Okay, that's what I want. Go ahead. <laughs> now you can lower down. Okay, go ahead. Surprisingly, unexpectedly, unfortunately. Very good. Bravo. Excellent. You can go back and jump into hamaca. That's okay. All right. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome, guys. <laughs> You see, guys, it's really important now that you increase your vocabulary in talking about um, adverbs. As long as you figure it out, not only how to exp express yourself, but also the meaning of each of them, 
the writing, and if you find out or detect which ones are positive, which ones are negative, and which ones are neutral, you will be able to mix them up and also to use them when you're talking uh, or you're telling us a story about what had happened, for example. Imagine that you can say, a, I was walking down the street when unexpectedly I saw a celebrity, right? Or also you can say, I was walking down the street when suddenly I looked down and I found $20. You see, like, woohoo! Now look, good. lucky you, right? You found $20, $20 or 20 bucks, right? Yeah, you need to understand that box is like slam, right? It's like we said in Spanish, chirilicas. <laughs> yeah? Box, box, box. No, yes. You, can, you said 20 bucks. 20. Mm -hmm. 20 dollars, 20 bucks. You, for example, you can say, hey, guys, how much is that? Hey, that's 20 dollars. Oh, that's 20 bucks. But normally, guys, it is you said a uh, slam. That is a slam a word, a street word, right? But also you use it between your friends, between your family, somebody's school, with your classmates, like that. But it is but when you hear 20 bucks, that means twenty dollars. Okay, cool. So you see, we can use that. Uh, I, I'm gonna give you something, guys. I'm gonna give you um the first part of something, I was walking down the street when, and then you need to come up with a continue of the story, okay? Let me check. Oh. Uh -huh. ah, you don't know. Okay, everybody, uh, has everybody gone to the beach recently? To the beach? Recently? I went, I went to near to the beach uh, today you, you live near to the beach no I no don't. jose uh, i visited uh today i went to uh how can i say cerca de nearby near, near, near by? Right? nearby nearby the beach oh <gasps> no which one because we have a lot of them <laughs> all right El cuco um, I, went, Espino. I went to acajutla today <gasps> Acajutla, I, I love that beach, you know, I love it. Yeah, I know there is a nice place, but it's too hot. Yes. Ah, yes. You know what? And it's one of the closest places that you can get into Guatemala, right? I think is where is it? Uh, Safari Chapin, right? Yeah. Y you can get it from there. I love that place, but it's really hot. Ooh. No. Yes, sometimes. yes, you're right. And Jose, I don't know what is the name of that beach, but I remember that one of my friends said that if you arrive on that beach like um, at five thirty a.m. in the morning, you can you you can you can see like a different fishes for different kind of colors, and also you can watch the parrot fish. You know what parrot? Mm -hmm. Have you seen the parrot fish? Yeah. The one no. that eats the corals only in TV. <laughs> no, but we have it. Yes, but because in this in this song, I don't remember the beach. The beach have a corals. Uh huh. It's when, a, a protected zone. Mm -hmm. When you see, for example, a beach that the sand is a little bit white, it is because of the parrot fish. And the parrot fish, the the mouth of the parrot fish, it is is part of it because it looks like the the, the parrot ones. I think, let me find it out for you guys. I'm going to, have to send it to you. It's beautiful. I have seen him in, in person, but uh, in Tela, in Honduras. In Honduras. Oh, it's a beautiful yeah. place. Yeah, but uh, I haven't seen him here in El Salvador, but it's really beautiful. He looks like a parrot, and but it, it is not big. It is not big. Let me check. I'm going to put it like parrot. Wait a minute. <laughs> parrot uh, fish there you go mm -hmm. let me check <laughs> it's so funny let me see which one which one i have seen here 
Well, they're, they come from different colors. I had to let you know that. I think the one that I saw in Tela was uh, the blue one, like Esmeralda color, something like that. Let me check. <laughs> they are really nice. They're lovely. Mm -hmm. Okay, let me check, see if I can send it to you right now. It's great. This one is really nice. Let me see. I think I'm going to send it to you right now. Just let me know as soon as you're able to receive it, please. Okay, I just sent it to you. That is strange. I have never seen. It is a strange. It's not common yes, fish. But it's beautiful. It's beautiful. And do you see that the, the, the little mouth is like, yes, a like a parrot? It is because that helps to bite the coral. It's, it's, oh. it's dirty. Uh-huh. And, the, and he's, uh, he's really important in the ocean environment. He is really important. He, here in El Salvador, we do have, but I don't remember, Jose, what's the name of that uh, of that beach? I don't remember. But I know that it's in Acajutla by heart. Yeah. But I don't remember it's the beach. It's near to the Cameron, I think. No, Cameron, uh, the, uh, the, no, the, no, it's not that one. It's the name, no. I think. Because the it's, it's Los Cabanos, but no. That one, that one is not. Uh, the, the, the Cameron, when, you, when you're going, when you're coming from the from the freeway, uh, the Cameron, I think is you have to make like a turn left, but and to the Scavanas, but the, the one that I'm letting you know is on the right side. So I don't remember that name, but as soon as I figure it out, I will let you know, okay? <laughs> okay, guys, so you see, uh, you can say, for example, when I was like in the, yeah, let me see a, a sentence. You can say, I was visiting the coast, last year when unexpectedly I saw a parrotfish. You see, you can say that. So guys, the, the, the phrase that we're going to use is this one. I was visiting the coast last year when, that is going to be our phrase. I was, I'm going to write it on the chat right now. I was visiting the coast last year when okay mm -hmm. when ah, and guys when if you're going to use the what whatever of the adverbs that we have seen right now guys you had to put it like this way i'm going to write it down mm -hmm. when uh unexpectedly uh, uh, when I saw Angelina Jolie. Ah, yes, of course. <laughs> on the beach. <laughs> when sun on, on, the, on bikini. Uh -huh. uh, <laughs> who said that? Rainer, right? No. Jose. No, I know. Uh -huh. <laughs> I was, I was. When suddenly. Yes, the teacher is Rainer. Uh -huh. uh, I was Rainer. Uh -huh. Thanks God he was tired, you know. Yes, very tired. Yes, very tired. Hmm. And when he's still joking. Huh. <laughs> yes, yes. very good and suddenly let me check it out something really quickly guys before i continue oh yes i know i knew it okay there we go but suddenly i saw a carrot fish okay okay that is my sentence i was visiting the coast last year when suddenly i saw a parrot fish guys look at that when we uh, insert the adverb, suddenly, unexpectedly, sadly, whatever, you need to uh, insert it by you separating commas. De acuerdo. Vamos. When, comma, suddenly, comma, unexpectedly, whatever adverb you want to use. You, when you write it, you separate it between commas. That is really important. That's why I wrote it to you. So my question is, Oh, my sentence. I was visiting the coast last year when suddenly I saw a power fish. What about you guys? The, I was visiting the coast last year when, when, when Rainer, repeat your sentence, please, if you don't mind. <laughs> well, surprisingly, I saw Angelina Jolie. 
Om bikini. Oh my god, on, on a pink bikini, by the way. Okay. Yeah, it's valid to keep dreaming, right? I'm just kidding. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. <laughs> All righty, very good. Now, Rainer, select another classmate. Select another one. Nah, I don't know. Yeah, you know, big one. Okay, Leticia. Leti, okay, okay, Leti. I was visiting the coast last year when? Um, <laughs> Don't tell me that you saw Brad Pitt because well, I will kill myself. So I so I surprisingly. Uh -huh. Surprisingly, uh huh. Um, you need to use a verb in the past. With surprisingly, and uh, surprisingly, uh, a new park. Uh huh. Surprisingly. You saw, you visited. Uh, I visited a new park. Very good, excellent. Now let me pick somebody else. Um, Jennifer, you can speak Jennifer. Uh, Jennifer, Jennifer, Jennifer. It's, it's nice. <laughs> I'm sorry, okay. Jenny. I'm sorry, Jenny. <laughs> I was visiting the coast last year when strangely started rain. Ah, yes. But you know what? That's common, right? Yes. That's common. Very good. Strange, strangely. Very good. Excellent. Strangely. Jenny. Okay. Jenny, now select somebody else. Jose, okay. You can select Jose if you want. Mm. Gabriela Gutierrez. Gabriela Gutierrez. Where is Gabriela Gutierrez here? Oh, yes. Gabby, go ahead. I was visiting the the coast last year when surprisingly I saw uh, I forgot the a snake uh, a snake a snake? coral How snake this? I was yeah uh, but in the water in the uh, water in the water I don't know the name of this snake that anaconda Lang no, anguila, anguila, Boa. maybe. Ah, anguila, yes, anguila. Anguila, anguila. Uh -huh. No. When surprisingly, I saw an anguila. Oh my anguila. god! I, so, no, no, no. So I don't want to pass through that situation. I love anguila. I can eat anguila. They're really delicious. They are like. Really? Yes, they are like. They are sweet. Oh wow! <laughs> Especially in sushi, they have an anguila sauce. Ah. And it's okay. really sweet. Mm. I well, know that. but I don't want, yeah, now you know, but I don't want to like uh, yeah. uh, have her visit me, right? You know, mm -mm, no. it's mm -hmm. food. I can get an electric, electric shock. Okay, very okay. good, Gabby. Now select another classmate, please. Somebody else. Uh, let me see. Hey, uh, Saulito. Glenda? Hey, Glenda, okay. <laughs> good evening, everybody. Good evening. I was oh. lighting the candle when the siren rang. Okay. What? I was riding camel when the siren rang. I no, I but just another one. I was visiting the coast last year. <laughs> Recently. Yes, because that is a really, really hard to think about. I, I she already have it that, you know. She no, yes, when I went to Israel, I was riding camel when the siren rang. I were there uh, for 28 days. 28 days. days. Uh -huh. uh, 28 days, uh -huh. almost a month. Oh my goodness. That was a really <laughs> nice experience, you know. Yes, I'm going to look for a picture and I'm going to send you. Hey, that would be awesome if you can do that. You know what? Mm -hmm. uh, don't worry because I think uh, because of Glendy, I'm thinking about your homework, guys. So don't worry about that. Okay, okay. Right. <laughs> mm. okay Glendy, do me a favor, pick somebody else. Mm, let me see. You can have mm. Gabriela, Car eh, Carlito, uh -huh. Liz, Paolo, Dani, Roxy, Paul, Oli, uh -huh. Oli. Sa Saul, Saulito. Uh -huh. Saulito, we cannot hear you. Can you hear him, guys? No. no. Saul, Saulito, we cannot hear you, Saulito. I think he's going to use his like earphones. Yes, or is he problem with the microphone because he, he's opened the microphone, but 
we can hear him. Uh -huh, we cannot hear you. I'm gonna write it down in the chat. Yeah, he's trying to speak, right? But I think something happened. He can fix it later on. Let me see, I wanna listen. Edwin Chacon, please. When I was lucky, I see the sirena in the beach. Sirena. How you say sirena in English? Mermaid. Mermaid. Mermaid, yeah. A mermaid. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I was lucky to see the mermaid. A little mermaid. <laughs> A little mermaid. You said Ariel, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. And Sebastian, what is Sebastian? Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Saulito, I don't know what happened. I think Saulito is trying to fix his audio right now. And last but not least, I want to listen Jose. Uh huh, Jose. Uh, I was visiting the coast last year when, unfortunately, I lost my wallet. You what? You lost your what? Wallet. Your wallet. Ooh, you lost it because you left it on a rock over the sand, or somebody like took it from your pocket. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> yeah. And th that, that had happened to you, really? Yes. Oh, my God. I'm sorry about that. Guys, talking about that, this is what I want you to do. This is going to be your homework. I'm going to send you something like it's going to be like uh, a little example. But your homework will be to tell me more than a simple sentence. Okay. Huh. So this is what I'm going to send it to you right now. I want you guys to write a short story about something that happened to you recently. And please, guys, try to include uh, some of the albums from the one that I gave it to you. At least, hopefully, you can include it fine. Okay, I'm going to send it to you something. And please let me know if you receive it because it's, this is kind of things that I need you to write. I send it to you right now. Do you receive it, guys? Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah, do you receive it? Yep. Okay, so this is what I want. Yes. Ba basically, guys, a little a story about that. You said I was visiting the coast last year when unexpectedly I got a change to go, yeah, parking, right? Fortunately, it was perfect day and I was having a great time. The water was calm and I was beginning to feel a little bit, a little tired when suddenly, blah, see? So I just want you to give me just like a um, short story about what had happened to you recently and try to use at least five albers. Or if you, if you use it less than that, that's okay. But I want you to use more than one. Don't tell me two, okay? <laughs> no, three, <laughs> three albers at least, please, okay? Try to use it. And we're going to listen to your stories tomorrow. I, I will expect your stories that you cannot imagine, guys. I think they will be really amazing because I don't know what happened to you, but everybody has a really interesting story. Something interesting happens to you, right? Hey, Jose, you know what? You can start with your, with your sentence, like the one that you got your wallet lost. And then you can continue with that story. That would be amazing. Because we, we, because we want to hear the, the whole soap opera, you know? <laughs> okay, guys. It's time to say goodbye. Yes, right? Time. Yes, I know. So you have to go to sleep. You have to have uh, dinner or drink a cup of coffee, right? Thank you so much for being here, guys. So hugs and kisses. Yes. See you tomorrow, okay? Thank Bye. You. Bye. 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 Bye.